안녕하십니까? 2022학년도 11월 고등학교 2학년 전국연합학력평가 영어영역 듣기평가 안내방송입니다. 듣기평가는 파정 없이 시작됩니다. 이제 문제집 표지를 넘기시기 바랍니다. 그러면 지금부터 3교시 영어 영역 듣기 평가를 시작하겠습니다. 듣기 평가는 1번부터 17번까지입니다. 1번부터 15번까지는 한 번만 들려주고 16번부터 17번까지는 두번 들려줍니다. 방송을 잘 듣고 답을 하시기 바랍니다. 1번 다음을 듣고 여자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. 이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이
4번 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Mindy, how did clothing donation day go? Dad, it was such a wonderful event. Do you want to see a picture of it? Sure. Oh, you drew a t-shirt on the banner. Yeah, my club members came up with the idea. Great. Are the shelves under the clock for the donated items? Right. Do you see the basket on the round table? Yes. What's that for? We put donation badges in it. We gave handmade badges to donors. How nice! Oh, I can see three boxes next to the chair. Those were ready for donation to the charity center. We organized the donated clothes and put them in the boxes. I see. What's the picture on the wall? That's the picture we took with the people at the charity center last year. It looks nice. It must have been a fun event. O Bun, Tewar d i k o n a m j a g a h a l i l o Kajang c h o k j a r a n g a s i l k o r u s i o Science Lab Day is tomorrow. Let's do a final check, Kevin. Good idea, Becky. I printed out the list of students who signed up for Science Lab Day. Thank you. A lot more students signed up for it than we expected. There are enough chairs in the science lab, aren't there? Don't worry. I checked the number of chairs and even brought some more yesterday. What a considerate thing to do. And I downloaded the video clip that explains the safety rules. Good. It'll be important to show it before the experiments. How about experimental equipment? I put everything on all the tables. Oh, I forgot to bring laboratory gloves from the preparation room. Don't worry. I'll get them. Thank you. Then I'll check the first aid kit. Yuk Bun, Tewar d i k o Yajaga c h i b u r a k m e g l k o r u s i a Welcome to Extreme Indoor Rock Climbing Center. Hello. I'd like to try indoor rock climbing with my son. It's our first time. Okay. If it's your first time, I recommend that you take an intro session. It takes an hour. Great. How much is it? It's $20 for an adult and $14 for a child. I see. I'll take an intro session for one adult and one child. Okay. Do you have indoor climbing shoes? You need special shoes for climbing. Can we rent the shoes? Both of us need them. Yes. The rental fee is $3 per person. Then, you want an intro session for one adult and one child and two shoe rentals, right? Yes. Oh, can I use this coupon? I downloaded it online. Sure. You'll get 10% off the total price. Great. Here's my credit card. Chilbon, Tewar d i k o Namjaga, Lail b i k e r Taragalsu Omnen i u r k o r u s i a Hello, Anthony. What's up? Hi, Lucy. I'm calling about borrowing some costumes from the drama club. Oh, but I'm on my way to my part time job at the moment. Okay, then maybe I can pick them up tomorrow. Anyway, how is your family gathering? I had a great time. Oh, my uncle gave me a coupon for the rail bike at Crystal Riverside. Do you want to go with me? Sounds great. When do you want to go? How about this Saturday? This Saturday? I'm afraid I can't. 
Oh, I remember you have your soccer practice every Saturday. Not this week. It's cancelled. Then why can't you come? I have a musical audition scheduled on that day. Okay. Good luck on the audition. Eight. Ten. The phone will ring. Winter Robot Camp. Is it recorded? Sarah, what are you doing? Sarah, what are you doing? Hi, Thomas. I'm looking at a leaflet for the Winter Robot Camp. How about going with me? Sounds interesting. When is it? It'll be held from December 28th to 30th. That's good. The semester will be over by then. Right, and the camp will be at the Watkins Robot Center. You know where that is. Yes, I've been there several times. Can I see the leaflet? I wonder what programs they'll offer. Sure, here it is. Oh, they'll provide daily programs on robot programming, drone flying, and coding. Yeah. It says participants will work together with other students with similar levels of experience. It sounds like fun. How can we register? It's simple. We can scan this QR code and complete the form. Great. Let's do it now. 9번. Go Greener Festival에 관한 다음 내용을 듣고 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Hello, listeners. This is Hans Dale with upcoming event news. Do you want to feel festive vibes for autumn? Then the Go Greener Festival is a perfect event for you. This event will be held from November 11th To 13th in Central Park, songs about the environment will be played. Stages will be built using recycled materials. You can buy food which is all organic and served on edible plates. If you bring your own water bottle, you can get drinks at a discounted price. To reduce the festival's carbon footprint, the parking lot will not be available. Don't miss the opportunity to go greener. Stay tuned. 10번. 다음 표를 보면서 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 주문할 직소 퍼즐 세트를 고르시오. Honey Since we had fun doing a jigsaw puzzle last time, why don't we order a new one? That's a good idea. What about a famous painting again? We can put it in the living room this time. Let's look online. Look, these five models are the most popular jigsaw puzzle sets. Great. Which painting do you want this time? We did water lilies last time. Yeah, let's choose something new. What do you think about the number of puzzle pieces? How about doing something more challenging than 400 pieces? I agree. And I think spending over $40 for a puzzle set is too much. Right. Oh, we can choose the frame as well. Which one would be good? How about a wooden frame? I think it'll go better with the living room. Okay, let's choose this one. 11번. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Paul, what are you writing with that brush? It looks really artistic. Thanks, Clara. I'm practicing calligraphy. 
It's my first time seeing someone doing calligraphy. Who did you learn it from? Shibibon. Tewarel de Go. Namjae Majmang Mare de Han Yojae Ungdaburo. Kajang Chokjoran Gosil Gorushio. Hello, Blue Lagoon Scuba Diving. How can I help you? Hi. I'd like to register for an indoor course on Friday evenings. Let me check. We have two courses on Friday. The 7 p.m. is fully booked, but you can take the 8 o'clock course. Shipsambon, Tewarel de Go, Yojae, Majmang Mare de Han, Namjae, Ungdaburo, Kajang, Chokjoran Gosil, Gorushio. What's that, John? Oh, is that the bookcase you ordered online? Yes, Kelly. It was delivered today. I'm trying to put it together, but it's quite complicated. Hmm, it doesn't look easy to assemble it. Right. I hardly understand the manual. It's my first time trying to assemble DIY furniture. I'm so confused. That can happen if you are doing something you're not used to. You're right. Oh, didn't you say you had assembled a computer by yourself? Yes, and I also had difficulty understanding the manual. Then how did you do it? I searched for a video and learned how to put it together. I think that would be quite helpful. Yes, it explained every step well. There will be many videos online that can help you too. Ship Sabon, Tewarel de Go, Namjae, Majmang Mare de Han, Yojae Ungdaburo, Kajang Chokjoran Gosil Gorushio. Honey, what are you watching online? It's a documentary about ugly vegetables. Interesting. What does it say? According to the documentary, one third of all vegetables are thrown away at farms. Just because of their appearance. I can't believe it. That's such a shame. Yeah, they're wasted even though they're as delicious and nutritious as good looking vegetables. So, does the farmer's hard work just become useless? Right. I think we should do something for the farmers. I agree. Why don't we search for a way to buy ugly produce? Great idea. Let's find it on the internet. Let me do it. Look, this store is selling ugly vegetables at a reasonable price. Shibobon, Taum Sangang Samyongel Deko, Sophiaga Henniege Halmalo, Kajang Chokjoran Gosil Gorushio. Sophia and Henry teach literature in high school. Sophia has worked for 10 years, and Henry has just begun teaching. At the beginning of the semester, Henry assigns a book to his students and has them do a presentation about it. However, he notices that many of his students don't show as much interest in the book as he expected. So he asks Sophia for advice. Sophia knows her students are highly motivated when they pick their own books. So she wants to suggest to Henry 
that he allow his students to choose books for themselves. In this situation, what would Sophia most likely say to Henry? Hello, students. Last class, we learned about different expressions in various languages related to birds. Today, let's talk about what birds represent in different cultures. First, the eagle was a significant bird in ancient Mexican culture. For ancient Mexicans, the eagle was a symbol of the sun. As a predator, the eagle was also associated with strength and power. Second, in Chinese culture, the crane stands for intelligence and honor. It's admired for its ability to walk, fly, and swim as well as for its graceful appearance. Third, in ancient Greek culture, the owl was a symbol for the goddess of wisdom, Athena. The owl's abilities to see, fly, and hunt effectively in the dark often implied magical powers and mystery. Lastly, in some Native American cultures, the hummingbird is a healer and deliverer of love. That's because of its ability to move incredibly fast. The hummingbird is also considered a symbol of joy and good luck. Isn't that interesting? Now, let's watch a video to help you understand better. Hello, students. Last class, we learned about different expressions in various languages related to birds. Today, Let's talk about what birds represent in different cultures. First, the eagle was a significant bird in ancient Mexican culture. For ancient Mexicans, the eagle was a symbol of the sun. As a predator, the eagle was also associated with strength and power. Second, in Chinese culture, the crane stands for intelligence and honor. It's admired for its ability to walk, fly, and swim as well as for its graceful appearance. Third, in ancient Greek culture, the owl was a symbol for the goddess of wisdom, Athena. The owl's abilities to see, fly, and hunt effectively in the dark often implied magical powers and mystery. Lastly, in some Native American cultures, the hummingbird is a healer and deliverer of love. That's because of its ability to move incredibly fast. The hummingbird is also considered a symbol of joy and good luck. Isn't that interesting? Now, let's watch a video to help you understand better. 16번. 남자가 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것은 17번. 언급된 새가 아닌 것은 